Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing a reading for Sign of Leo. And keep in mind that this will not resonate for every Leo. If you'd like a personal reading, that is going to be the first link in the description down below. I repeat that first link in the description down below for a personal reading. You can also find a bunch of other things in the description there. You can find my Etsy shop, or you can find my tarot and my oracle cards on there. Alright, you can find my holographic stickers, as well as the mini uh, holographic version of my oracle cards on there. You can also find... I forgot to get these earlier. But you can also find my pins as well now. Alright, so we have the green man. Make sure that you see that. We have Serapis Bay. And as well as the white raven here. Okay. It's all in the description down below on my Etsy shop. Um, what else? Oh yeah, you can also find my shirt store at my website, different social media platforms I'm on, even Twitch and Patreon. All that's in the description down below. And if you like donating to the channel, feel free to do so. I do appreciate your donations here. So, Leo, let's see what is happening for you. Number four with the storekeeper wanting to come out. It says, tell your story, legacy, write your wisdom. All right. Number 31 with Beauty and the Beast, Unconditional Love. Number 26 with Little Boy Blue, Dreams Come True, Return of the Soul. Number 17 with Acorn's Invitation, Touch, touch, eh, touch Exchange, Connection. Number 30 with Far, Far Away, Creative Daydreaming. Number 5 with Secret Doorway, Working with Intuition, Second Sight, Opening Dimensional Doorways. Number 15 with stolen in her sleep, unaware, unconscious, unawakened. Number 36 with child of the moon, forgiveness, transcending the ego. Alright, so look at this, Leo. There's a bunch of things happening. Uh, look at this. You have passed through the secret doorway here, maybe even through your sleep, okay? Somewhere far away, like in a spiritual sense, right? It's telling you to write that down and share it with others, what you've learned through that here. Okay, and then we have a connection coming through where it's unconditional love. Beauty in the Beast, that could be you and that person there. And with Little Boy Blue, that can be like dreams coming true, but it can also be like a little a little boy in the future. That's just something there. But we have Child of the Moon, so you are connecting with the moon here, Leo. Oh my god, Leo. I think, I think we have Leo Moon, this next full moon. Like it's Aquarius season, but it's Leo Moon. Full moon on the 16th. And number one with the three graces, cooperative ventures with friends, joy, sharing new partnerships that are fun. Okay? It's gonna be like friendships, can also be reunion, because three graces must be the three cups. Okay, let's see. Number 38 with the Green Man's Bride, Sacred Union Commitment Ceremony, maturing into deep relationship. Number 41 with Mother and Daughter, Mothering, Teaching, Sharing Knowledge, Nurturing Self-Worth. Number 18, Fairy Tales, Letting Go, Detachment, Moving On. Number 18 with Scared to Fly, The Right Moment, Sensing Out the Right Timing. Number 20, with the littlest fairy, appreciate the beauty and value of the exquisite and small. Number 33, which is an important number, Marlin, guidance, mentorship, teacher of the old ways. Number 6, with the dark moon, maturation, growing up, introspection, know thyself like this. You're connecting with the Marlin, the green man here. Okay. There's a doorway that's been open for you. Littlest fairy, which feels like yourself, you've been maturing as you may have let go of some things here. We have mother and daughter. That could be like your mother or your daughter if you have one. Um, that bond there. Then we have the green man. 
So a couple things here, Leo. You could be manifesting a deep commitment, like in terms of love. It can also be your commitment to spirit here. Okay. Number 21, Crystal Magic, Creation, Dawn, The Beginning. Number 43, with Midnight Prince, Ask for What You Want, Be Honest. Number 29, with Into the Woods, Stranger in a Strange Land, New Experiences, Feeling Uncertain, Transition Zone. Number 32, with Beauty's Truth, Beauty, Physical Pleasure, Sensuality. Number 25, with the Grail Fairy, Fertility, The Return of Life, Health, Life Cycles. Number 24, with Golden Gift, Magical Help is on its way. Number 12, with the Grossmere Princess, communication, relationship work to be done. Number 34, with Glimpse, Indigo, Rainbow, Crystal, Children, and Beyond. Okay, so we're working with some crystals here, Leo. Alright, we have a, a golden gift here coming in, which is what you've asked for, what you asked, you will be receiving. It could be some relationship work that's going to be done here, okay? Like, I mean, like, work done, not done. <laughs> uh, that can be that deep, churning commitment there. You have a lot of new things coming up for you, okay? So this can be like stranger in a strange land. That could be like a spiritual sense. You understand? Like you're going somewhere spiritually, and it's new to you. It can also be that of travels there, and it feels like you may be having glimpses of like future children and future generations. You have your grail here. We have Leo. We have number 39, Shimmer, Glamour, Confidence, Allure, Charisma. Okay. Number 28, with Once Was Innocent, Knowledge Means Change. Number 23, with Follow Me, Come. This is your invitation to enter the realm of the fairy. Number 27, with Carry Me Home, Support, Time to Be Carried, Allow Others to Help. Number 2, with Solace, Return to Nature, Tree Wisdom, Natural Remedies, Flower Essences. Number 8, with Cry for Nature, Mourning for Something Sacred Which Seems Lost. Number 46, with the Fairy Lovers, Courtship, Romance, Falling in Love. Number 13, with Catch Me, Trust, Surrender, Leap of Faith into the Unknown. Yeah, we have love here, Leo. Alright, so you're having an invitation here to Spirit, okay, to the Green Man, the Merlin. Just gonna unlock. Uh, this door has been unlocked for you. You can really pass through it, right? Asking for what you want. That's gonna be granted here. But that feels like a, a love here. It can also be children. Because that's one thing that was coming up for you. This this knowledge here has changed you here. Okay. It feels like you're jumping into this. It must be something with nature here. Maybe a love which once seems lost to you. Could be coming back around. So let's get some ruins and some charms here, Leo. So we have Serapis Bay. Serapis Bay is an ascended master of light, and that feels like that may be what you're connected to. We also have Aries. So maybe you have some Aries placements, or there's going to be one around you, or whatever. We have this one. This one. This. Okay, so okay Leo, look at this. So we have... We have abundance coming in. This is something that has been opened for you. Things are going to be more in flow here, Leo. Okay, with that flow thing, that can also be water. It's going to be like water signs, whatever. Uh, we have births, we have new beginnings here. With this being here, it's all very magical here. Okay, so that is all I have for you. And like I said, first link in the description down below. For a personal reading. 
Also go to my Etsy shop, go in there, go buy something, really appreciate that. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye guys.